So, I'm going to explain a very important character, a Chinese character, Xin, the heart. And you can see it is really a picture, a joint of human organ, heart. This side, the outside, a room, another room, and another room. It's a picture from the inside. You pronounce it as Xin X I N. This is a pinyin way, the first tone. But I will also put it in another way. That's a traditional Chinese way, a zhu yin way, zhu yin. Actually, the Japanese way. So, E N. The first tone you don't need to write it. So everybody, if nothing is right, and that is the first tone, xin. So this xin is very important, not only for the human, uh, human body. Without heart, nobody can survive. But also, it is very important uh, in the Chinese language and also in the Chinese culture, because this xin is made to. Uh, it's used to make to make up a lot, a lot of Chinese characters, and there are two ways. For example, this one, yes, this is a tree, as you see, yeah, uh, and this side is a eye, very big eye. So, if somebody with very big eye or is climbing in the tree, and he will see. A lot of things he will see, everybody, and everybody will see also him. Okay, so this one, this character, to look carefully, and、uh, means also each other. So he puts the heart and、uh, looking very、uh, looking each other, and it means 想 so just to look each other in each other's. Heart, that is a 想心想，就是 heart as thinks, yeah. Um, you say according to the Chinese philosophy that thinking is not an activity of brain, but as heart. The brain、uh, listen to the heart to、um, carry out the activity of 想 of thinking. And this, you have two ways to to、uh, two ways for the pronunciation, two ways to write it. One is Pinyin way, X I A N G, and the third tone. You have also Zhu Yin way. Zhu is this is Xi Yi Ang Xiang. The third tone. Put it here. Okay. And there is another way to to make characters, the xin with the xin, and you just put the xin at the beginning part of another character. Okay,、uh, and this time you need to put the let the xin stand. See, like this, change a little bit, and this normally you you can neglect it. The only this this three is enough. But as calligraphy, and、uh, people write in this way, and here you put another character here. This what this is to produce, to give birth, or to grow. So anything which is produced by your heart, or grows in your heart, or born in your heart, is your character actually. That is real you, and. This one you pronounce it as xin x i n g, okay. The first tone that's the Pinyin way.、And、the Zhu Yin way is xi yi in first tone. So xin. So you have xin xin. That is mindset and heart character, and xin xiang is heart thinking. Is it? Think the activity, yes, that's true. And、um, heart activities, activities which is、uh, related to、uh, heart, and then the heart is is put at the bottom, like desire. 
uh, you will see later. And uh, anything who is produced in your heart or by the heart, that is feelings, emotion, uh, that kind of uh, characters this in, the, in this way. Put it at the beginning um, part, and also it stands, the heart stands. So, uh, Xin is very important in the Chinese culture. The, all the wise Chinese teacher, teachers from the old time till now, they, t- they teach the Chinese people to be pure, to be simple, to be kind in the heart. And that is called Xiu Xin. Xiu literally, that is to repair your heart. And later I will explain it. Xiu, how Xiu, you will write Xiu, okay? And that to repair your heart is the most important task of your whole life. That is cultivation. Okay. Um, that is for today. Thank you.